unready with me. So I'm going to take off all this makeup I got going on right now. And I'm just going to show you all the products that I use. Some of them I've used them, had them for a while now, so I don't judge how it looks because I got like makeup on it. But um, we're in my bathroom right now. That's why you see this towel in the back of me. But if you haven't already, subscribe down below. My name is Marlene. Welcome and let's get to this. So um, first things first, let's pick this hair up. I'm going to remove my makeup with this Yes to Cotton. Um... My, my cellar cleansing water, I think they call it. I don't know. If you guys watch my videos, you guys know I can't pronounce nothing. So, we're going to say whatever. My cellar water, I don't know. But it says protects and minimizes irritation, ultra sensitive, and allergy prone skin. Because I have sensitive skin all the way. So, and what I love about this, you just go like this. You push it up and down. And that's it. And I use one of these little pads that I got from... Target. These are the premium cotton ovals. Cream Radiant Clarifying Cream Cream to Foam Cleanser, and I've had this forever. That's why it has like um, those black spots are um, from eyeliner. So I'm gonna wash my face with this real quick. So then, after I cleanse my face, sometimes, like, if I really want to really cleanse my face, and this is what I use, like, after, like, I'll do a mask or something, I'll use this. I love this. This is the St. Ives Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Scrub. It's amazing, and you can find this at Walmart or Target. So, after I always use a cleanser and I wash my face, I always go in with the Thayer's, Thayer's, Listen, once again, I can't pronounce nothing. Um, Witch Hazel in Rose Petal Alcohol Free Toner. Just to make sure I got all the makeup off. Because you never know. You can miss a spot. And once again, I'm just going to use one of those little pads. <laughs> this thing smells amazing, by the way. And I have really sensitive skin, and this work 
works amazing for me. Good luck, guys. You see that? There's still a little bit of stuff left over, even washing and cleaning your face. So I suggest you always to get a toner. And then once I'm done with that, this is my old time fave, the Clinique Moisture Surge Intense. And I will be moisturizing my face with this. But before I moisturize, I'm going to take my contacts. Although, one of them already just popped out while I was taking off my makeup. There we go. And guys, this moisturizer goes a long way. So you don't even need that much. I do like two, three dots. We're going to do four today. But... I'm telling you, a little goes a long way with this. I did the fourth dot just so I could bring it down to my neck. And obviously I would do this after I take a shower. That way my face is all moisturized, but I wanted to show you guys this. Before it got dark and the lighting was bad. Because I can't film in my room because Adeline still stays in our room with us in her bed. So that's out of the question. So now that my face is moisturized, I come and I put on my glasses. And guys, that is it for today. I hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and if you want to see more videos like this like maybe um skincare routine or anything else just leave some suggestions down below and i will definitely do them for you guys and yeah so i'll see you guys in my next video Bye, guys.